although not yet widely equipped by the Korean Army. The K-808 8 armor vehicle has received the attention of the armies of Asian countries. It is intended to be used by rapid deployment units and operate in forward areas. A smaller 6x6 version is also being deployed, intended to be used for rear defense and convoy protection. The K-808 8x8 armor vehicles previously known as the KW-2, developed by Hyundai Rotem as a private venture in 2012. In 2016, these armor vehicles successfully passed final qualification tests and were approved for a procurement. The first batch was delivered to the South Korean Army in 2017. Full-scale production began in 2018. These new World Armor Vickers replace the aging K-200 series of track armor personnel carriers in the South Korean Army service. The South Korean Army plans to deploy 600 new World Armor Vickers, including 500 with 8x8 configuration at 100 with 6x6 configurations. K-808 of Korea has a weight of 20 tons. It has a length of 6.6 meters, a width of 2.7 meters, and a height of 2.1 meters. Standard crew is 2 people, plus 9 to 10 people in the passenger compartment. The engine is located in the front of the left side, while the driver sits beside the engine to the right. Troops enter and exit the vehicle via a rear automatic ram, in addition to four roof hatches. The K-808 has an all-welded armor hull that provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. It can be fitted with add-on armor for a higher level of protection. It is also equipped with the NBC and automatic fire suppression systems. It is likely that front arc withstands hits from 12.7mm armor piercing rounds. Vigor has a V-shaped hull for a protection against my blasts. The Vigor is provided with a remotely controlled weapon station armed with a 40mm automatic grenade launcher or 12.7mm machine gun. It can also support a two-man turret armed with a 30mm cannon and coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. In June 2020, Hangwa Defense was given a contract to deliver the 30mm anti-aircraft gun world vehicle system to the Republic of Korea military. A K-808 chassis fitted with a twin 30mm cannon turret of the K-30 Baiho. It has greater range than the Vulcan Air Defense System it will replace. The K-808 armor personnel carrier is powered by Hante Turbojet's diesel engine, developing 420 horsepower. The engine is located at the front. It is mated to automatic transmission with seven forward and one reverse speeds. Vigor has an automatic drive line management system. Two front axles are steerable. The K808 
is fitted with a central tire inflation system and run flat tires. It has a maximum road speed of up to 100 km per hour, much faster than the previous Trek K200 armored personnel carrier. K808 is fully amphibious. On water, it is propelled by two water jets. This armor vehicle can cross rivers and other inland water obstacles. Maximum amphibious speed on water is 8 km per hour. My video about the Korean K808 armor vehicle answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Tạm biệt và hẹn gặp lại quý vị và các bạn trong các video tiếp theo.